Hello, welcome to this podcast. My name is Beatrice Mars. I am a singer songwriter from France. So today I'm going to try to look at the camera and nothing else. It's not going to be that obvious, but uh, usually I usually look at the computer screen, my laptop screen, exactly. But now I'm going to look right in front of the camera. So I'm going to try it through the whole podcast. So just to say that as usual, I'm recording this podcast and I will put the video on my YouTube channel called Beatrice Mars. So if you want to see me, then you can go to my YouTube channel called Beatrice Mars. So today, I'm not too sure about the title yet, but you've seen it already. So since you, you're listening to me right now, is that uh, I've come to make a mea culpa somehow. Because the other day, I said to you like something like two weeks ago, I started to record again, it was on a Sunday, and I haven't finished the track. I put some instruments, the basses, basically usually track, it's usually the kick, the bass, and uh, I can't remember, what was it? I, I don't think it was an electric guitar. I'm not, yes, it was the electric guitar, actually. So, I'm not too sure. Well, I haven't arrived that much. I tried to put some um, some lyrics, a chorus, but uh, I haven't listened to it, so I'm not too sure if it's going to work or not on that. But anyway, just to say, and afterwards, I did something I haven't, I haven't been doing for ages, which is listening to my own music. Before, um, when I was actually producing two albums a, a year, I was pretty much listening to my, to my old stuff all the way through. And I have to say, since in 2020, I haven't listened to my music that much. And uh, if you've been following me, you know why I've been like, um, I mean... I'm fooled is that when well basically I was my attention is, is on what's happening in the United States in the world right now in the world right now so I, I was to I, I didn't have too much time to actually record it's a choice because I wanted to know what was going on for my safety first of all and also to uh, to lower the stress of the, the, the whatever anxiety what was generating with uh, with the whole situation. So I did not listen to my music until until it was last it was last week actually. Or the beginning of it. No, it was the beginning of this week. And uh, maybe around the weekend. And I listened to me. I listened to me, yeah. And um, I went to <coughs> excuse me. And for the record I usually listen to my music on my hard disk drive. That's it. On my computer, nothing else. Uh, basically, I'm I'm actually listening to the original recording. Okay, so uh, so I was just listening to 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 my music. So sometimes I'm kind of ecstatic. I'm say I'm saying to myself, "Oh, that's such I'm such a genius," and somehow, well, and uh, I can show you that I can see what's wrong with it and what's not wrong with it, and it helped me to say to 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 change and to maybe improve and saying, "Well." I've done that at the time, but I shouldn't. Uh, I should not do that in, in the future. Basically, that's the way I see it. So I was kind of pleased to listen to my music, and I realized that uh, because all the time, I mean, for the past uh, few podcasts, uh, I was saying, well, I didn't do anything in 2020 in terms of music because, as I said to you, before and when I started in 2017, again up to 2019, I was kind of producing two albums a year. So 2020, I never produced anything at all. And I was meant to release in April 2020, album number seven, which I did not release. And today I've got, and uh, right now I have the opportunity to try to release it again, but I haven't got the, the cash to do it, so I'm not releasing it just yet. But as soon as I got some money, I can spare, not for food, just money I can spare, then I will release my, uh, my, my number seven. And... Um, Yes, so I was uh, well, I was looking into the, uh, the folder and I realized, well, I've actually made something like five tracks in 2020, which is uh, so many. I thought it was next to zero, but in fact it was five tracks. So I'm kind of pleased to say that I did, did do some work. So I know that most of the work was prior to, uh, to the start of the quarantine in France, basically. We call it confinement in France. And uh, it was like just well before I think uh, there's one in April, and then it just stopped. 
I couldn't basically my, my mind was on something else so I couldn't actually record at all so I'm pleased to say that actually I did some work in 2020 even though I did, I did not record two albums like I was meant to do as I used to do basically the way it works with me when I decide to actually start to do some work uh, it usually takes something like three three months four months to actually record an album so 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 it did not happen really in 2020 it did not happen since i've done five tracks i think and it did not happen so far so far so good but it did not happen in 2021 and i cannot say that in 2021 i've recorded a full track so far i've recorded one i think for yeah two weeks ago was for for, for the first time i actually sat down and um, recorded something basically but uh, i did not do anything at all so i'm pretty pleased with myself i said well i want to realize that when i realized that i said well wasn't that bad after all 2020 wasn't that bad and to me it wasn't that bad at all because when i'm actually actually looking at the statistics the stats you know the licensing was good to was good to me in 2020 and it looks like it's going to be good to me in 2021 anyway the start is quite good so i'm i'm very pleased with it and that's the reason why i would encourage you to actually release your work whatever you do because you never know uh in ter- you may not have the audience that you wish to have but you may unbeknownst to you you may fall into the licenses territory in the licensing territory and benefit from it somewhere so why i was uh, i was talking to the other day with someone i said to i said that person well and i've i was saying that because i've been in those shoes before yeah i thought yeah i needed some money so i went to work for a company and then it just like swallowed me into something where during 15 years i didn't do anything in terms of music at all at all at all because i was be d- i was be too busy doing something else and and somehow killing myself so f- softly so i knew about it and then i said to you in 2013 i said to myself you either do it if you start because when i started to record again i had to buy a few pops and pieces namely an audio interface so I could record myself again. I said to me, uh, at one point, when I started, I wasn't too sure, but then when it came into the thing, because I remember the idea came to me in December 2016. I was awake at the time, just something just was like a light bulb in my mind. And then I went into action in early 2017. And then I think between early 2017 and April 2017 when I released that my very first album called Delirium Tremens in between that, that, that uh, period of time I said to myself hold on you starting to spend some money on, on the gear again so you either gonna record it and publish it put it out in out into the world or you're not gonna do that so therefore you're not gonna spend any more money on gear and that was that thing and uh, i said to myself when i uh, when i analyzed what was what was happening with the um the whole it situation the internet and everything i said to myself this has never been a better time to do it so you either do it right right now or you're not doing it at all and then as you may know since you're listening to me right now I've actually um well I've, I've done it basically number one wasn't perfect it was like me trying to get to grips with the uh, because before i was recording but with uh, another type of equipment so it was me trying to get into grips into with what i had under my under my hands and not really being able to record the things i really want to record somehow i felt like i was frustrated and it's not the case anymore i'm glad to say it's not the case anymore but i did it so it's not perfect i know it's not perfect but then it was something uh, it wasn't meant to be released until i kind of put my se- put the gun into my um into my face i said to myself you either do it or you don't so which i did so do i regret now right now no but i have to say from 2017 to 2021 because in between that period i remember i had one licensing and uh, really i got what one cent i was paid one cent and it took i would say it, well, i have to say to 
between like because it started really study for me in uh, 2020 so it took something like three years to, to get into licensing so with me doing no work whatsoever to promote myself okay as i say what i can say still say is that in 2020 i did no promotion whatsoever of my work i wasn't abs i was like an absentee on instagram i was an absentee in, on facebook and i did record a few things for um, for youtube and my podcast but i never did anything and honestly now that i really understand how the, the social media platform are working i'm not planning to spend any yeah, any money at all so it will stay organic it has to be organic so and then my ego is not that when i think about it it's not that high so i i would do anything and anything to actually do whatever basically it's either it's going to come to me or it's not going to come to me uh what's it my job is if i feel like i need to create i should create and whatever i do whatever i do i should put it out into the world that's the way i think about it right now and uh, i think it's going to go on forever and it doesn't matter if people like it if they don't like it because I realized very early on is that the way internet is working is that and the way the system is working is that you cannot please everybody but there are many there are maybe a, a large number of people are, are not gonna uh, are not gonna like my music but there's another large number of people who are gonna like it as it is so and so far um, I feel like I'm proven right so I will carry on the way, the way it is. I'm not gonna lie I would re very much appreciate another laptop but I can't afford it the same way I can't afford to actually release album number seven but hey that's life so maybe it's not the time and basically when I release it it's gonna be much better for me so I don't know so I don't know I don't know uh, I really want to release number seven in 2021 but uh, right now it's a bit uh, yeah it's a bit uh, it's a bit like not happening so how come i've come to say that uh, i was wrong when i was saying i didn't do anything in 2020 because i did i did record five complete tracks but i'm very pleased with a uh, number one i was very pleased with number one uh, when i first uh, heard it actually it's a, some kind of track the, the time of track that you are recording just like you get up, you do something, you know you need to record, you record it, and you just know it's there. You just know it's there. So that's it. That's a kind of track. So I'm very pleased with the work so far. So I don't know. And I've got also, I know for sure, apart from those five tracks, I know there are other, I mean, other projects that are starting during the time. But because I was like all over the place, I did not finish. So sometimes I do come back and... Uh, work on them and sometimes i don't so i don't know so that's it so 2020 was when i really think about it on term in terms of mu my music career it was actually a good year i cannot complain and it would be selfish for me to complain and when i think about 2020 even in in general in my whole life with personal on the personal uh, it was at time very arduous uh, basically last year at the same time I had basically no money to eat okay uh, but but if I actually look at everything it was actually it, it was actually a good year so in terms of music to me it was a good year so okay so somehow it's it's not a lot but uh, basically in what you're kind of double my earnings so i'm not uh, basically in one year i heard i heard somehow more money than in the past uh, three years knowing that it's a very small amount of money that i cannot actually cash in right now but uh i would say i'm not desperate but i'm less i'm less desperate than before because i realized that what i thought originally in 2017 uh, basically i was right i was not wrong and time will tell me how far that thing will go but uh, 
Yeah. Yeah. So just to say, when you've got an idea in life, it doesn't matter if uh, people are saying that uh, it's mediocre. It doesn't like, it's not worth anything. If you feel like you need to do it, just go for it and uh, wish for the best. And anyway, at the end of the day, it's what you've got in your heart. So if you want to do something to actually give some some kind of pleasure, some fun to people, then uh, that, that's that's about it. And as I said to you, as I said before in another podcast, who are you to say that? Uh, who are you to say that a, a track is too short, or who are you to say that uh, your tr- any track is irrelevant? Uh, let what I'm saying to that is let the audience decide. So I'm going to finish that uh, podcast on these words. Thank you very much for listening to me, and thank you very much if you uh, if you've gone so far as listening to my music on your favorite uh, streaming platform. And I hope that you will come to listen to me again on this podcast, or come to my YouTube channel and watch me on this podcast. Thank you very much. Bye.